cloud computing is a, a relatively new concept where the data of multiple companies and individuals are pooled together on shared resources, thereby reaching economy of scale. For example, if you're using Dropbox or Netflix, if you're streaming movies, or if you're using iCloud, uh, uploading pictures, you are already using cloud services. Now on the cloud, suddenly many people are sharing the same computing hardware. And because cloud servers are shared, there is the possibility of a malicious party to monitor parts of the hardware while you are um, executing certain security algorithms. If they get enough of these observations, they might be able to infer um, information about critical secrets like cryptographic keys. And they can basically impersonate you and then they can do all kinds of things you don't want them to do. What we are doing in this lab is we are looking at hardware level leakages and we are trying to identify ways to exploit them to reveal cryptographic keys and commonly used cryptographic libraries. Once we uh, identify these vulnerabilities, we are developing patches for them and then contacting cloud service providers as well as cryptographic library providers to patch their software. When we monitor hardware, we observe memory accesses and look for specific patterns that occur when the cryptographic key is used. We actually took it all the way to the Amazon cloud and showed that we could co-locate with a victim and that we could actually recover the cryptographic key just by monitoring hardware resources. It's always a mixed feeling because on the one hand, yes, you are happy that your work actually worked out. On the other hand, you showed that there is a weakness to uh, existing service that we use all the time. We shared our results with the Amazon team as well as other cloud service providers and cryptographic library developers. Based on our findings, the IT technicians as well as the cloud service providers are paying more, more attention and in general patches are uh, more readily available and, and updated more frequently. As technology matures and changes, there will always be new vulnerabilities occurring, so it remains an arms race between building um, countermeasures and actually coming up with new attacks. But overall, in the end, this makes the systems much more secure.